Hello, and thank you for watching another edition of Redbeard Shaves. Today is a viewer request. I'm going to be doing a hardware review on the PAA Open Comb Slant. This is a Bakelite laser, razor, very, very light, hollow handle, and it is a slant open comb, very aggressive. A razor to respect because it's so light. In this razor, I have a brand new pulse silver blade. The viewer that requested for me to use this razor only shaves once a week. So I have about nine days growth on my melon. I just got done moving into the house. I've been painting, I've been doing a lot of stuff. So it was a good time for me to let my hair go. Um, for software today, I'm gonna to be using Lakewood Smokeberry, nice slick soap. It's going to help me mow this growth down. I have my beautiful turn and shave brush with a 28 millimeter tip knot in there. So I'm going to go ahead and whip the head and get this shave going. Hope you guys have been having great shaves out there. I know I've been gone for a while. I have missed you, but I am back. Some of the craziness, some moving and whatnot has uh, slowed down some. This is gonna be what's kind of bare right now. This will be my new permanent shaved in to call home. Using a little bit of the soaking water as a pre-shave. All right, let's get this lathered up. I had the crazy notion in my head to paint the entire interior of the house before we moved in, which I've got about 90% complete. Just got some trim left to do. I have this bathroom left to do and one other bathroom. So last night was the first night that we slept in our house. It was wonderful. We've been still sleeping in the trailer because I've been painting and then my wife and I had ordered a new bed so we're waiting for that to come in. So I've been busy, busy, busy. Hope you all had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Hope that you have a wonderful Christmas or holiday season coming up for you. Whatever you choose to celebrate. Hopefully it's not too stressful. Find time to Enjoy family and those that are close to you, because that's what it's all about. I'm just going to work this lather into the hair really, really good, because I have so much growth. I did do uh, my Be Bald Exfoliator in the shower before this shave. Get down there nice and deep as well. So this should turn out to be a mighty good shave. And it is way past due for me. I was uh, kind of crying to the wife last night saying, I cannot wait for tomorrow to shave. I almost just went ahead and made this video last night, but Bared right down and made it through, and here we are today. Looking forward to it. I have reviewed this Smokeberry scent before, but for those of you who have not caught this video, this is one of my all-time favorite scents. It's uh, made by Lakewood Soaps, Linda Morris from Jefferson City, Tennessee. It has a wonderful blackberry scent, very fresh blackberry scent with just a hint of leather to it. Brings back a lot of really good childhood memories for me. So it's a scent that I gravitate to quite frequently. Okay, that's pretty good there. One of the really cool things about this razor that you're gonna find out really quick here is that it has fantastic audio feedback. This razor really sings, especially when you have a lot of growth. I 
there's no problem mowing through this growth. You just got to make sure that you're careful not to put too much pressure down. Or like I said, it will bite you. There is a fair amount of blade exposure on here. This is about the most growth that I've shaved off at one time. I think before this, about six days is about the most. Pole silver blades are one of my favorite blades. That's why I chose this today. Nice, sharp, smooth blade. razor is fairly smooth and efficient it's definitely efficient fairly smooth with this much growth I do get a little bit of tug um, if I only have a couple of days of growth it's not quite as tuggy so if that's something that bothers you something to take into consideration um, three or four days in the against a grain pass I'll definitely get a little bit of tugginess going here today but it's still pretty comfortable. It's getting phenomenal slickness off this liquid soap. I've been so busy, I'm even behind on a lot of the other YouTubers' shave videos. I gotta catch up on all those. Start doing that on my drives to work next week when I go back to work. On my lunch breaks. See what all the other YouTubers have been up to.
feels so good to get this shave in. Getting ready to head over to colder weather today. My sister's baby shower. It's a unisex baby shower, so I participate in that. Okay, I'm gonna drain this water and rinse my head for the second pass, because it is all full of hair. sink fill up again while I go in for round two. So I am going to attempt to just do my standard two-pass shave. I won't be surprised if I need to do a little bit of cleanup after my second pass because I have so much growth here. And because of that, I'm not going to necessarily frost the top in case I need to do a third pass. I'm just going to put an extra thick layer on. Paint it on real good and then go for it. And see against the grain where you really have to be careful of your hand pressure so it's really easy to put extra pressure on the razor when you're going against the grain and that's where if I'm gonna bite myself this razor will bite me Okay, pass number two. Not too tidy actually, pretty good. Just love how this razor sings.
this much growth, I'm just going to take my time and take my other hand, kind of feel over the past I just went. See if there's any areas I just missed. I'm going to tell you what, this razor is doing a great job taking it down to BBS. No doubts about it there. Excellent shave. Ooh, I feel normal again. Very nice. I used to use this razor quite a bit, and uh, when I was first starting out, because when I was getting my skin used to the razor and shaving before I was able to daily shave, I would only shave every three or four days, and so I used this razor quite a bit then. No worries at all about going over bare skin, the slickness from this soap. 
It's very, very slick. somewhere on the back of my head see a little bit of pink but for the most part that was a good no blood shave and I am BBS I'm gonna go ahead and cold water rinse now Sure to rinse out the sink. A bit nasty. It's nasty, nasty, nasty. Oh, that feels wonderful. All right, I have a little bit of the matching liquid smokeberry balm. Put a good little serving of that on. Rehydrate the skin. Smells so good. And that is my shave of the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I sure did. I was uh, begging for this shave about five days ago. And I uh, hope you guys are having wonderful shaves out there. I hope this helped the viewer out that requested this razor. Um, I really enjoy it. Can get a little tuggy on the against the grain occasionally, but not too bad as you saw right there. So hope this helps you out in making a purchase or not. And uh, if you like this video, give me a like, hit the subscribe button, and this is Redbeard out. Shave on, my friends. Goodbye.